hello and welcome to the video. Welcome back to my playthrough of Project Zomboid, my first solo run. Now, I never said I wouldn't die in my solo run, I just said it was my first solo run. It doesn't matter how many times we die because it is all the first run I am learning. And if you tuned into the previous two, you know that uh, <laughs> Bucket Hat Cat kicked the bucket. And then we we became nurse cat right so now we are back at it again with nurse cat we a uh, little small recap somehow made it into town on accident kind of stuck in a building but we're gonna make the best of it today and let's hope and pray that nurse cat uh doesn't kick the bucket like bucket hat cat did <laughs> let's see how much further we get today huh okay so let's hit continue Thank you so much for all of you who have been giving me tips, tricks, comments, and all of the so such uh, down below. I really, I really appreciate it. And all of your expertise is going to come in handy and helping me survive. So keep doing that. Keep giving me details on how to survive. All of you veterans who have been playing this game a lot longer than me, bless you. Bless you so much for your information. I love you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's hope that it comes in handy, shall we? Hopefully this isn't how we died this time. Okay, so we are back in the area where we left off. Uh, we have ourselves a guitar weapon right now. And we're going to explore this building. No, <laughs> nope. No food, just toys. As delightful as that is, that's not that's not helpful. Um, it's, okay, well, I, what did I expect? This is a kid's room. I don't know what I expected. But we will take this dirty bandage and we will clean it. Cool. Um, and let's fill our water bottle. Okay, so we are depressed, agitated, getting bored. Do I have anything to- yeah, I can read a newspaper. That looks like a door got- oh, there's a zombie. Okay. Okay. Alright, I don't know what's in that way. We don't really need to find out right now. Ooh, a kitchen. Shut this door. Okay, let's see what we find. I need to find a screwdriver. I was told that even though I can't find a can opener, I can find a screwdriver. I can open stuff with. This is a locker room, okay. Come on. What can we do to not be over -incumbent? What? Why are we over -incumbent? Is it just the... Ooh. I'm tired. Uh-oh. He found me. I don't want him breaking my door. Yeah, I don't want him breaking my door! No. Stop. No. No. God, no, stop. Okay, now he's dead. I do have a screwdriver. Wait a dang diggity second. I should be able to open canned food with a screwdriver. Right? No. I can't. Weird. Ow, cat. That's my thigh. Ow, cat. That's my thigh still. Morning and depression. Uh, do I have anything to fix that? Hmm. I don't think I have any antidepressants. So I think the answer is no. Another tidbit you guys told me is that I can actually open this. Stop reading. I can actually open- I should eat the, the fresh stuff first. 
Um, I should be able to open the tuna without a can opener. So that's good. And the corned beef hash. I'm gonna read until I'm tired again. One eternity later. Jesus Christ, woman. Just fine. Eat the rest of it. Eat all of it. You're still peckish? What the crap, my guy? I think I need to cook those potatoes. There is a way to cook downstairs. Right. So that didn't cook them. I'm gonna take those back. Those are my potatoes. Maybe I need something to cook them in. If I have any chance of survival, we are going to need to not, you know, be all hungry do. Okay, temperature's at 400. Yeah, that's it. It should be fine, it should be fine. Fresh, but not cooking? Okay, cool. Guess we can eat that now. I just need it to be defrosted. Let's eat half of the patty and see if that's enough. I need a saw, I think. Be able to disassemble things. Let's, let's find out. Carpentry. Yes, I don't have any of the things I need for carpentry, so I can't make this place my base because I can't make it safe. Dude, stop being so bored, would ya? Christ on a cracker. Oh, 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 shit! I didn't mean to break the fucking window! Fuck. They're gonna hear that. <sighs> Girly pops, that was scary. Please. You're okay? You're okay. Good. Uh, let's continue reading this. I know that we're severely depressed, but there's not really much I can do about it. You're just gonna have to do what everybody else does, uh, nurse cat, and live with that depression. You know? Get bored? Don't care. Go to sleep. Middle of the night. Why did I wake up at 4 a.m.? You peckish? Sucks to suck. You're not eating until you're hungry. Oh good, I see the sun rising. That is some massive fog. Oh, I hate that. I don't care if you're getting bored. Better than being dead. <laughs> Alright, so that guy seems to have stopped banging? I'm gonna take that as a good sign that he went out the broken window. I kind of wish I could get to the roof. Or like, disassemble the stairs or something. So I could feel a little safer. But you know, it is what it is right now. I left the oven on, didn't I? Ah, yes. I sure did. I sure did. While the stuff's still on, we might as well enjoy it, right? Get our meat patty out of here. How could she be bored when she's cooking? Like, come on. I can be so bored. Oh, yum, yum, yum. Stale chicken. My favorite. You know what? We'll take an empty bowl, because I think if we do that... We might be able to make, uh, soup. Oh god! Oh shit! Don't you- Nope! Nope, don't freak out! Kill it! Oh my god. That's what I get for not paying attention. I wish he had a gun on him. I mean, not that I would shoot the gun right now, but it would be nice. I need to get this corpse away from my the door, or it's gonna give me corpse sickness. And I need to move it. I guess I'll move it over here by the stairs. I want it as far away from me as possible, honestly. Let's take this hoodie. Is this hoodie 
what would you replace? What what would what would you put up? Yes. Let's replace that so that it's my neck will be more covered. And let's uh let's put her to bed. She's 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 tired. She's she's stressed out. Needs to get a little bit of Z's. Okay. Uh crossword. That's gonna help her with, uh, with the depression. Right? Like that's gonna help with the depression. That's good. Do those crossword puzzles, girl. Chase your bliss. I sure did decide to eat <laughs> that potato when I was full to the bursting. All right, let's sleep. Okay, so we ended up all the way over here. That's where we are. And we started over here and we were gonna you know clear that area out um and then we we got scared because i hadn't played project zomboid in like two weeks and when i don't play for a while i get kind of skitterish which is exactly what happened and i ran and <laughs> it was not a good idea uh and we went too far i gotta get her out of here but like, how do I get out of here without dying is the question. Like, I have to like, get through the town. I mean, I am more protected than I was before, right? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm more protected. That's, that's not the problem. Problem is that she is upset severely. It's been five days, and we've killed ten zombies. Nurse Cat's doing pretty good. But, not great. She's surviving, not thriving. That's for sure. You know what I never checked? I never checked in here. What even is in here? Ah, another locker room slash a bathroom. Okay really sucks because that means I'm gonna I can dismantle that I'm gonna take that upstairs and dismantle that get my electricity up a little bit it means I really am gonna need to leave I'm gonna have to make a plan to how to get out of here alive right okay I'm over encumbered but I can take this upstairs Okay, that's, that's, that's big. Let's make that hard for them. Maybe they'll forget about me. Oh, they're not gonna forget about me, are they? Maybe they'll just meander downstairs. Best case scenario, they just hang out downstairs, right? I didn't realize I could pick up the mini fridge. That's awesome. That, that means I don't need to like, I can, I don't have to carry the food on me. I can just leave it here, which is really good. And it will stay fresher longer. Uh, I just need to be able to bring a uh, stove. Ooh, what if I can disassemble the stairs on both sides and I can just use uh, a rope to climb up and down? That would be really cool that would be really smart if i could do that okay i need to buff up my carpentry period like if in order to survive this in order to get anything else done i need carpentry we need carpentry too because then i can move this um into one of the safer rooms grab everything I can grab like food wise and bring it upstairs there I ate zucchini I'm peckish now so whatever is what it is um let's read our book 
how much does it take to get your carpentry up? Or like, how much reading? You have to read the whole book? Like, okay, you're very hungry? Oh my god, okay. Quit complaining. I got a fresh steak for you. Eat that steak, girl. Eat that steak. Yum, 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 yum. Delicious. Now you're going to tired. You're going to tired town. Let's go sleep. Maybe you'll sleep all night for once. Huh? You think you're gonna sleep all night for once? No. She gonna wake up. I need to break something down. I need to be able to break something down. The problem is, until my carpentry is higher, I can't get planks unless I find an axe and I go outside and I, you know, do something. But I can't right now. Well, it's a good thing you can't die of boredom. Agitated, bored, depressed. Okay, well, we need to get our carpentry up. All right, cool. Let's grab whatever's left. Take upstairs. Oh, shit! I don't think I need the oven anymore! Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, I get it. I'm unpleasantly hot. What do you want from me? Oh, I extracted the hood. I didn't know I could do that. Yeah, let's let's <laughs> let's take some shit apart. Let's fucking do this. Oh, it's electrical. Oogie, oogie, oogie. Good. Okay, cool. Can can you just get out of here? <gasps> Ooh, girl. I'd be disassembling like crazy in here. Well, I've had cigarettes this whole time. Oh, but I don't have anything to light it with. What if I use the stove? Okay, listen, that's not fair. That's not That's not fair. That doesn't seem right. All right, cool. We've gotten to the point where we can disassemble tables now. Oh, hell yeah. <gasps> nails! Oh, yes. Yes, mama do want nails. What can I do with scrap wood? I'm aware I'm unhappy. I don't know what you want from me. I don't have anything to make you happy! I'm just trying to keep you alive! Please! Go to bed. I get it. You're super, super sleepy. In the middle of the day. Hey, we all take depression naps sometimes. Let me guess. Pain in the neck. Uh-huh. Yeah. Is that gonna cheer me up? No. But this will. We're gonna eat all of this cocoa powder. That apparently makes you happy. I mean, I know I like chocolate. So that makes sense. Is there a Carpentry 2 book in there, I wonder? I get it, you're hot. Let's fill our empty bottle. I'm moist. That's fine. Cool. Good, <laughs> good job being moist. I could just find a lighter. I know the smoking would help her depression because she's she's a smoker. Hello again. Carpentry 2. I can't even read it right now. Ugh. Bollocks. I hate it here. Can I disassemble you? Yes, I can. Let's work on our carpentry skills. Ooh, did I just get a plank? <gasps> I did. It's weird that I'm excited that I just got a plank. Ooh, I'm about to level up soon. Oh, hot dog. Yes! Carpentry one, here we go. Awesome. Freaking awesome. Let's, let's call that a win. Go lay down. He's tired. 
Oh, I'm so excited. Alright, let's uh let's take a little sleep. She deserved it. You deserve it. Go to bed. So freaking proud of you, cat! So freaking proud of you. Put that baseball back on your bat. Back. Back <laughs> on your back. Will that count towards my crafting? I hope so, but I'm cool with that being like a spiked one instead. <laughs> I'm real cool with that. I need to go find things that I can disassemble. Can I disassemble this door? <gasps> I can! Okay, good, because I don't need this door. The window's broken anyway. What are we gonna do with the door? Please, I'm trying to get you. I'm trying to make you survive. Oh, I didn't realize that I had frozen. I'm trying to make you survive. Oh. No, that was dumb. I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, I'm starting on level two. That's what I need. All right, this place is about to be out of water. So, ooh, I could barricade. That's useful. Take these chairs apart. No! What do I need? A garden saw? That doesn't make any sense. Come on now. Fine, I guess I'm going downstairs to disassemble some stuff. How am I doing so far, guys? You think I'm doing alright? Now I'm heavy, so I'm gonna have to finish disassembling these doors and go upstairs and drop off my plank. Okay, cool. Um, let's eat a potato. I know, I know. You've had such a such a long day. Building those carpentry skills takes a lot out of you, girly pop. True. On my way back to your food. I'm gonna give you a potato. Okay? Want a potato? I will give you one. one I potato. need it! You like eat one potato? Yum, yum, yum. Ooh, a plank. Hell yeah. Gib. With enough of these planks, we may be able to build something to keep them from coming up the stairs. Oh, that would be so good. Yeah, you know what? It's better to be hot than cold. He's like, I'm so hot. So sweaty. Yeah, because I don't want you to get bit. Still can't read this carpentry book, which I would love to read the stupid carpentry book. I need to get to the next level of carpentry. Ooh, I'm halfway! Mmm, I'm so close. Is there any other food down here that I missed? Just wanna be sure. A sack of potatoes! See, that's what I'm talking about! That's what I'm talking about! Holy crap! I missed an entire sack of potatoes! Girl, we gon' we gonna eat good tonight with our sack of potatoes. Um, let's get back upstairs. This doesn't feel safe anymore down here. Right there. Particularly. Now that I know there's no door there. Don't feel safe. I, now, I don't know about y'all, but I don't know how many potatoes are in a sack. But that sounds like a lot of potatoes, though. How many potatoes is that? I, don't, I couldn't tell you. I don't know. I don't know how many potatoes that is. Go sleep, sleep. Go sleep. Oh, I'm so happy for her. She is finally sleeping. But I'm really worried about the office area, like, calling forth the vengeance of the zomboids. <sighs> so that might not be a good idea. I don't know how much they can hear me hammering is the problem. 
Like, that's what I'm worried about, right? We don't really have a choice. The only way to fortify is for us to go get our carpentry skill up. Right? And the only way to do that is to break shit down. Yeah, they're still trying to break that door down. Oh, God. Uh, I have to do it, though. Got one more to do. We can head back upstairs. I would really like to save some of these potatoes to farm with, uh, but I'm going to have to go out and find more food and disassemble more things. If I want my skill to go- Oh, I'm so close! <laughs> oh, I hate it! Ah, oh, okay, it's at, uh, 112. If I build something- Hold on, let's check something. If I build something- Grab one. Will it- Go towards my carpentry? Did that do anything? A little bit! Ah. Uh, Alright, well... <laughs> next episode, I think I know what we're doing. Let's go to sleep. She's real tired. <sighs> Let's get her one last potato to eat. I want to know if you guys think I did uh, did better than I've been doing, right? Don't forget that I stream every day, except for Monday and Tuesday, on twitch.tv slash katanachan. So check me out over there. If you like my content and you like this Let's Play and you want to see more, heck, if you want to see me do more Let's Plays of other games, follow me. Uh, leave a comment down below. Subscribe. D d watch, uh, watch everything on my channel. Watch it several times. Share it with your friends. Share it with your mom's friends. Share it with your mom's friends' friends. That's how I know you like it. But that is going to conclude this episode. We are currently sitting at 11 zombies killed, 9 days survived with Nurse Katana. Let's go, Nurse Cat. I'm very proud of you. I don't care that you're peckish. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye.